Okay guys, welcome back to Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts Part 5. Um, so, I think anyone who has ever given me a PM or a message on how to beat the green ginger thing, um, I did not need your help though. I did figure it out, and I wanted to start it here. We're going to go back in. I see you're back. The jiggy that you want. It's basically saying your jiggy's in that bank there. And that you got to take it from that bank to the big globe that I've seen before. Done. Da, 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 da. Do, 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 do. Do, do. So hopefully the volume's good. I fixed it perfectly. Um, and I've just learned how massive this game is going to really be. It's it's going to be huge. Yeah, whatever, buddy. This is basically explaining. I have. I want to show you guys some things first before we finish up that world and go into the next one. And I do apologize, I'm going to probably do a couple a day because this game is going to be huge. I'll probably do maybe two a day or something like that. I don't know. I haven't decided yet if I'm sticking with one a day. Just because this game's huge to start with one. And there we go. First Jiggy. My first bank. Kaboom. And that's our second world unlocked. Ah, uh, do you see? Banking your first Jiggy has opened another door. Act 2 of Nutty Acres. I think you're grasping the basics, so I'll leave you to explore, chat, and add to your Jiggy account. One last piece of advice. Defend yourself by pressing the X button to swing your wrench. Should you acquire any tips or reminders, bottles of the man, or the mole, to see. Now, I have a second file. Banjo doing good, so Humbo gives special award of, blue, of new blueprints. Humbo and blueprints to vehicle database so Banjo can use when in game worlds to play Jiggy games, not use around town, though. Which sucks, I have to say. We get the Humble Racer 1. Eh, it's not bad. We got some nice speed. We got the taxi. And the truck. Hey, Banjo. Humba just get delivery. Now have new vehicle parts and vehicle blueprints to buy. Come and see Humba in the town square. Anyways, what I've been trying to say is I have two profiles of this. One where I can just go monkey around, which I have been doing, I will admit. Oh, that's how come I know some things. Um, but it, it's not more or less that I'm going to levels. I've kind of just been exploring Showdown Town. Because that's just, the, to me, the best part of the game. But I have found out how to broke the game. Now, you come over here by bottles, and you see this electrical force field. When I was walking around, I did not mean to break the game when I did this. Like, when I mean break the game is I kind of glitched it out. And we're not going to do it in this path, but I'm just going to show you guys. You come over here. And I, I wanted to get up on this roof, and I was like, cool. Now, is there a way for me to jump up and get... Oh, no, not do that. There's still a slight leg, I, I have to say. Not bad. Oh, come on, get up. He's not getting up there. Easier with the vehicle. We'll do it with the vehicle. Anyways, you get up there, and I wanted to get up on the roof. I couldn't figure out any other way to get up on the roof. Except for I said, oh, these things I can walk on. I can nearly walk on any surface. So I get up on my vehicle. Jump up here. I'm like, oh wow. Delicious dishes. Now I try and jump up here. He can grab up here. You go up. Go up, and now you're stuck. But if you. Just like that. I was like, oh cool, now I'm up on a roof. That, that's kind of cool. Get some jiggies. Or not jiggies, some notes. I was like, oh sweet. And I'll probably get some more parts here. Since they... But the thing is, on top of... I noticed this when I was climbing. All of a sudden I was like, oh, I could climb that telephone pole. Or whatever it, you guys want to call it. I'll show you guys once we get all these notes. And we'll get that box. After I'm done with Nutty Acres with Grunty and all that, that's when I'll really explore this lower area and start exploring Showdown Town so we can get more parts and I can build better vehicles to do things. But anyways, I got up here. That's number 30, so that's kind of huge number for boxes. But anyways, I got up here. And I was going up. You can climb up here and get up here. And you can walk, and this is our first introduction to tightrope rocking. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap. And I'm not the best at it. I've kind of got better at it. Anyways, this is what I was doing in my other file. And you're like, how do you have two files? Well, I have two profiles. One is my LP the profile, and then I have this profile, or my normal profile, so. Anyways, you can get up 
And you pull off this spin move here. And looky here, we got past this slippery slope. And I thought this was awesome at first when I first saw this, so... And then we can, what, what you can do is you can collect these notes here like I'm going to. Oops, let's get that. This this actually is for you those who like to do speed runs. This is a good for you. But anyways, you can get up here and then you can activate this portal. Ah, uh, another warp. Parking your trolley on it enables you to hop from one warp to around another, to another around showdown town. Try it. And that's what I'm saying is, and Andy says you can't do it yourself. And here you go. You've unlocked everything. You can go around everything. See these slippery slopes? Don't have to worry about it. But we're not going to worry about that for right now. So I'm going to go turn in that crate so we can see what parts we got. And then we're going to go finish up the green Jinjo. I don't know if that'll be it for this video. But I'm going to show you how to get another achievement. You tuck the Humba Wumba. I've, I've looked at all the achievements, by the way. Good to see you, Banjo, again. Humba Wumba set up shop. Cross square from useless shaman Mumbo. You gotta buy a vehicle, and it looks at renters. My favorite, because I know what's coming up. I watched uh, what was it Double O Peasant or was it GTR Andrew showed me this? You buy this one for a later challenge in Act Two, and there you go. You get achievement unlocked, blueprint buyout. And it's just basically buy one blueprint from Humble Wumba. Now, like I said, I've been monkeying around and just looking and stuff, and I kind of like this is kind of cool, so I bought that too. And then I exit out of us. Like, cool. Now let's turn this crate in. And then we're going off to finish off Act 1. We jump up. I forget what's in this one. Move. Ah, uh, bear, bring another crate. What inside this one? Mumbo, open and put new parts in store. So. Oh, yeah, this is the one with the medium engine, medium ammo. And then you get all the heavy stuff. These are nice for Act 2, so which I will be making my own vehicle for Act 2. It'll Because I know all the challenges. They're, most of them are racing ones. So. A bear and bird and a lord of games. How nice to have for rivals. Okay. Ah. Let's go do this one. I, I, f I figured this one out on my own on the other file when I was just dinking around. I tried to do this one because it was like, oh, I'm going to have to figure it out anyways. So, I'll probably do this one and maybe one or two more videos. And like I said, these will be put up relatively close to each other. And I apologize for doing this, but this game is just going to be so freaking big. It's not even funny. I think this will beat Cyphron's. By far. Ah! Uh, so let's go over here. Oh, I even missed the Green Jinjo, too. <laughs> Because, like I said, I'm collecting everything in this game, 100%. We all the notes and everything. And for Shadow X143, oh, I still can't remember his number. It's 143 something. Two? Or six? Or something like that. There's a green ginger. I've been, uh, his I'll probably be talking to to get stuff, so. This is a Jinjo Fetch Challenge. Listen to the description, find the lost item, and bring it back. Sob, Sniff, oh, you've caught me at a terrible sad time. I've lost my most prized possession. Have you seen it anywhere? Oh, I have to apologize for the last video. It was very echoey, is my mic, and... And basically we just have to get his banjo, is all we're doing. So... Let's start the game. This is a fairly easy one. I was like, how retarded am I? It's actually really close. It's like let's get out of the vehicle. It's right over here. This is how easy it was. I was like, oh my gosh. I'm sorry. Ah, ah, ah! Leave me alone. So I take it this game's gone gone by fairly well. I had a hundred views on my first day with it, so I was happy. My hundred subscribers all looked at it, I think. I believe so. Come on, come with me. There we go. 
And there you go. Thanks so much, Banjo. I'll take better care of it. And I promise, on the other hand, I've always wanted... A... Well, sometimes this stuff doesn't scroll. It's okay. Now we'll go to here. Let's go to Showdown Town. And I guess I will see you guys next time on the next episode, because I'm about to go make my car. I'll show you what it is. I'm going to make a pretty halfway decent one. And then we'll finish up. We'll try and do Act 2 tomorrow. Or not tomorrow. Next episode. So, yep. Thanks for watching. Uh, rate, subscribe, do all the good stuff. Uh, and comment. I guess start adding comment in there. And I guess this is the end. This is the loading screen. See you guys later.